Though the ice will be void of Bucks action behind me here this weekend, all eyes will be on Des Moines as they duel with two of the top three teams in the USHL in hostile territory. Friday night, it's Dubuque in Dubuque, and Saturday, a date with the league-leading Chicago Steel at Fox Valley Ice Arena. Let's gear you up for a clash with the Titans this weekend on our Catch Des Moines weekend preview. This weekend's tough tests could not have come at a better time, as Des Moines has won four of their last six contests, including a weekend sweep at home here at Buccaneer Arena last weekend. Highlights were a 50% power play that went 7 for 14 on the weekend, and a spectacular Cameron Rowe in the net who earned himself USHL Goaltender of the Week honors with dazzling performances on both Friday and Saturday night. Saturday's 46 save performance from Rowe was his USHL best, and the veteran goaltender felt like last weekend's wins were a turning point for the Bucks. Here's why. The turning point was that we found our confidence. I think guys now under understand what we have to do on and off the ice to get success uh, every every night over the weekend. And I think that that's really something big. Is guys now trusted and understand what they have to do, and everyone's buying in one through twenty-five. Friday night's matchup at Mystique Ice Center will be the fourth edition of Bucks and Saints hockey this season. Currently, Dubuque holds a 3-0 series lead, but those wins did not come easy, as only one of those games was decided in regulation, with the other two going to a shootout and overtime. Dubuque has continued their defensive dominance all season, as they still hold the league's top marks for goals allowed, having seen just 81 pucks get behind their goaltenders this season. On Saturday, the script will flip, as the league-leading Chicago Steel are all about offense. Currently sitting atop the USHL, both in the standings and the goals for department, with 163 tallies, which includes a league-best power play at 25.5%, as well as having the most players in the league in the top 20 in scoring, including league-leading scorer Sean Farrell. Despite the illustrious and daunting rap sheet the Buccaneers face in both opponents this weekend, Director of Hockey Operations Sam Mayasic says the team is thrilled and confident ahead of grappling with the league's best. Uh, coming off the success last weekend, uh, it's really exciting going into this weekend. Uh, two of the better teams in the league uh, going into their, uh, their barns and we're going to play our game hard, fast and smart um, and, and disciplined. Both installments of Bucks Hockey will be live this weekend on the Buccaneer Broadcast Network. Until we set sail from Mystique Ice Center in Dubuque, I'm Ben Gislason here with the Des Moines Buccaneers, and this has been your Catch Des Moines Weekend Preview.